4S, the world's largest security company, is rapidly expanding here in Florida, landing millions of dollars in contracts from sheriff's offices that often aren't put out for bid. While Florida sheriffs have discretion in awarding contracts, some vendors say it's putting smaller security companies out of business and wasting your tax dollars. Investigator Adam Walzer has the story tonight. The person that's taking the hit that doesn't even know it is the taxpayer. G4S security guards are turning up all over Florida. Yeah, they have the market kind of cornered. G4S. G4S, uh, yes. Doing jobs once performed by sheriff's deputies in an effort to save money. It's in the millions, um, and I don't think there's any doubt about that. G4S has millions of dollars in active contracts with sheriff's offices in Hillsborough, Pinellas, Pasco, Polk, and Sarasota counties. But this security company manager, who asked not to be identified, claims G4S isn't always the cheapest. The small mom and pop companies doesn't even give us a chance. He believes the Pinellas County Sheriff's Office should have notified other companies about a three and a half million dollar annual contract awarded to G4S last year. Then every company would have been given a fair opportunity to be able to bid on it. That would, you know, increase us by about 60 percent. That's a huge contract. A very huge contract for us. Robert Downs is another vendor interested in the contract. He owns U.S. Prisoner Transport and says his company could have performed the jobs at a lower price. Our overhead is not going to be as high as them. I want them to grow their companies and have great businesses, but um, it, not everybody can have a piece of everything. Pinellas County Sheriff Bob Gualtieri signed the latest G4S contract, which was put out to bid only one in 2006. Since then, it has been amended nine times and grown sixfold. We're under no obligation and no legal obligation uh, to put everything out to bid. Tampa uh, attorney George Spofford, right who specializes yeah, yeah, in yeah, government yeah, contracts, yeah, yeah. says Florida has a bid law meant to drive down prices, but it doesn't always apply when it comes to public safety services. If you don't advertise it uh, and, and uh, seek bids uh, from qualified applicants, then you don't have competition. We would have been in a reasonable bid that gives a reasonable rate for a reasonable job. Which would have been lower than what they it would have been a lot lower. Records reviewed by the I-Team show Pinellas County pays G4S more than other agencies for similar services. Pinellas County pays $21.58 an hour for unarmed guards, while Polk County, where the contract was put out for bid, pays $14.37. Not necessarily a like-to-like -like comparison. Uh, an officer is not an officer is not an officer. The requirements are different. This one will hold 27. Requirements other vendors believe they could meet for less if given the chance. Ultimately, the taxpayers are the ones that are, are paying all this. Of all the sheriff's offices we looked at, only Polk County actually solicited bids for the current G4S contract. Now, we reached out to the Florida Sheriff's Association, which said that organization recommends soliciting bids whenever feasible. I'm my team investigator Adam Walser, taking action for you. Well, if you have something you'd like the I-Team and Adam to investigate, you can join them on Facebook or email them at iteam at abcactionnews.com.